I've slept about two hours, <laughs> so I'm probably gonna say many incoherent things during this video. But I've been awake and working on this essay so long, I just submitted it, and now I am ravenously hungry. So there's only one place to go, it's Najar's, and I'm gonna show you guys what it's like. Hey, Najar, how's it going, man? Happy New Year. Yeah, good to see you too. I'm so hungry, so I'm getting the unlimited wrap today. Yeah, yeah, the big one. Oh, it's, they have so many different ingredients, so many different flavors that they can put in your sandwich. And with the unlimited wrap, you can go all the way. You can just pile it and pile it and pile it. At one point, I was like, okay, I promise that's it. He's like, up to you, man. You want more? I put more in your sandwich for you. Extremely generous and I can't wait to eat it. It's gonna be so good. God, thank you so much. Wow. Here, look at this. Weigh this. Tell me that. Oh my God, I might have to try that. Yeah. This must weigh, it's somewhere between a pound and a kilo. That would be my guess. Eichhörnchen. I'm fluent in German. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. I can't wait to eat it. Look, look at the size of this. Look, I can't convey. I don't want it to, I don't want it to fall, but this is this is a proper wrap. I'm gonna try and keep it in there. Let's have a few bites. Oh wow. Okay. I'm gonna take a few bites, I'm sorry. It's so good. It's so good every time. Consistently delicious. Every time I've been here. I've been here. A few times. Things I like about the wrap. You can mix and match the flavors to be whatever you want. Uh, they've always got a large variety of things. And I feel like they cook a lot of the things fresh in-house every day. The different chicken flavors that they have, I, I really like those. The falafel is, is delicious and crunchy. And the bread that they use as well, unlike most other places in Oxford that will use tortillas, they use proper kubus, like proper Arabic bread. Um, that gets this lovely, lovely crunch to it when they toast it in their, um, in their panini maker. And if you're hungry, well, there's plenty of it. There's, I made an absolute mess of myself. I even dropped, I even dropped some of the pants. I can't stop, I don't know, I don't, uh... Mm. It's still delicious. <laughs> it's still so good. Can I be drunk from being tired and full? Is that, I don't know, is that a thing? Okay, 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 okay. Location, location, location. It's super central. Perfect location, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Taste, it's, it's so delicious. Hear me out. It's so close to being perfect. It's, it's maybe the best wrap in Oxford. If I, if I had to tick it off just on one thing, I'd say it's, I really like, like tzatziki. That's the one sauce they're missing. I'm, I'm gonna give it a 9.5 out of 10. Okay, that's still a super good score. That's better than anything I've, I've ever given out so far. When it comes to value, I mean, look, 10 out of 10. You get so, so much food for five pounds. I mean, yes, you can get proper college meals for less, but this isn't like other wraps or other street food. The amount of food that is in this is, is comparable to an entire meal, to two entire meals, I would say. Value, it's a 10 out of 10 from me. So, if you think there are any spots we should be checking out in Oxford, Please, please, please let us know down in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe. Hit that damn bell notification button. That is somewhere here, somewhere there. Hit it, hit it please. And you'll get notifications every time we post a new video. Tell us, just, just come. Let me rest in peace. Until next time.